Ow. Sorry, Skag. There we go. It's kind of fun that you can actually loot while you're in the car. I think that wasn't really possible in the first Borderlands. And what the hell is this? I see myself a badass sh shock skag. I guess I could kill it for some more experience points, I guess. Yeah, let's totally do that. If the car doesn't break down, though. There we go. More experience. Holy crap, the car is actually breaking down. I think I should stop doing that though. Oh, great, now the rack are back. Are you serious? Alright, now we gotta kill one badass Bullymon in order to get that part. If you got a car, it's pretty easy. However, my car is almost blowing up. There we go. Do I see something blue? I do see something blue. You know what? I'm gonna get out before the car explodes. Oops. I accidentally hit the car. That was not supposed to happen. Could you please move away from the car? Like, please. Thank you. And, um, let's see. We got ourselves a grenade mod and we got... Ooh. We got ourselves a better rifle. That's pretty handy because, again... <laughs> I said that my rifle was pretty shit, now I got myself a better rifle to use. I guess. Let's let's test it out. Let's see, it looks a lot better. And I'm in love with it. The reload is a little bit slow still, but you know I'm gonna take it for what it is. Yeah. See, that's the kind of weapon that I kinda need, you know, like you get a rifle, you gotta stick with it for a little bit, then you get something better, and then you're very happy. And this process continues on and on until you're like level, I don't know, maybe 69 again. That was a nice jump. Alrighty, so now we gotta repair the whole thingamajiggy again. Right, Scooter, whatever you say. <laughs> Didn't really listen to you. So let's replace all the parts. There's one part which is all the way at the top. And once we are done with that, we actually uh, power the Happy Pig Motel for, you know, like ammo dump and the. Uh, and the, uh, you know, what is the Dr. Zad? Oh no, is there a Dr. Zad in here? Anyways, more marker stuff, whatever, you know. <laughs> more ammo, more guns. Anyways, everything works. We gotta turn in the quest. Mm, we got a skin customization. And we got a yeah, available mission. Yeah, I know. We, it's like a timed mission. Um, here's the thing, actually. When you do it solo, um, especially at my crappy level, and here's the thing, you know, like, it's a really... Damn, it's not really a hard quest, but there are a lot of enemies and you gotta rush and that's kind of the annoying thing So I'm not gonna do that one Right now anyways ammo dump Let's see what he has to offer mm. When it comes to grenade mods, there isn't really a whole lot of spectacular stuff. I guess I'm gonna get myself some rifle Let's see Rifle ammo, do I have enough um, shotgun ammo? Because I think I'm actually quite low. Yeah, I'm quite low on shotgun ammo. There we go. So let's reload everything. And then we can go to talk to Mercy's lair. And I hope that I'm going to get myself another good gun. Because the last time I did this on my commando, I actually got a orange weapon from him. And if you guys know a little bit of the loot system, it's about that orange is one of the highest rare colors you can find when it comes to weapons and all. I'm still surprised why the car cannot go through that. I mean, come on, gearbox. I know you. I know. I. I kind of understand that you want us to force us to go alone by foot, but still make some sort of a barricade. You know, it's kind of annoying when you have to see an invisible wall for a car. 
That's my only complaint, but, you know, just a tip. Well, this place looks safe. Let's get the rifle and the shotgun out. Now let's test this baby out on some more things. The zoom isn't really that great, but it's it's better, and I like the the, the HUD and all the stuff. You know, it really shows like, hey, this weapon is cool because it got stuff and all. Anyways, let's open fire. I kind of do like the burst in this one, though. Let's see. There we go. Pretty efficient, actually. For long range, it isn't really that great, though. It's a little bit too much of a uh, scatter, still. Oh, crap. God damn it. Wait, great, I gotta fight for my life. Well, everybody is in there. I might as well give up. Yeah. That's annoying. That That's pretty annoying when everybody's there. Alrighty, my first fill of the recording session. And there are plenty more to come, trust me. Oh, wait. I'm back at the Happy Pig Motel, huh? Is there a catcher ride in here? Yeah, there is a catcher ride. Alrighty. That was kind of annoying. That, that's what I hated, actually. When you get the second wind, you know, the fight for your life uh, thing. Sorry. Um, it's kind of annoying that they all want to hide, and then you can move a little bit, but it doesn't really help much. So, yeah. And don't tell me everyone just respawned again, because if that happens, I'm going to be a sad panda. Anyways, my shield is also crap. Anyways, let's use the rifle again. Wow, that did absolutely nothing. Let's just throw a grenade then. Please don't tell me there's gonna be another <laughs> suicide psycho coming right at me. Oh, thank you, it's a nomad. Well, that's a little bit better. Yeah, my shield is almost down. I mean, holy crap. I got myself a crappy shield. <laughs> and like, um, the commander. I think that's because I'm used to playing my commando a lot. God damn it! Just die already! Just, just die already! Okay, there you go. I think I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit used to using my commando, so that's why I'm a little bit more reckless. Because I know I got some cool perks, and I got myself a, you know, a turret, which kicks ass. But now I got, I just got myself, and I got just a couple of things. So I guess it's time to go get gun zerking. Why the hell did you get myself my pistol? I want to get my shotgun and my rifle out. That was the plan. <laughs> I mean, come on. If you got yourself two badass weapons, why don't you use them both? You know? Maybe it's because of the, the, the slot or whatever? Or can I change it? That, that was kind of my... Uh... I don't know. I, I should still experiment with this war. I don't really do gun zerking a lot. <laughs> Anyways, I killed everything in here. Whew. So, let's just see. Is it, is it because of the slots? Um, I think so. So what if I just change this with that, you know, like, get the order straight. Maybe then it will work. You never know. Anyways, there is still one more bad guy I need to kill. Because we still need to get a mysterious weapon. And I think he just arrived, didn't he? No, he didn't. That was something else. <laughs> Got ourselves the gun zerking perk ready. In case we're in trouble. Just opening some stuff. And I guess I'm full of ammo, I guess. I guess I'm full with ammo. Let's see, reload. God, I like, tor I like Torque weapons a lot, and Doll. Doll and Torque and Hyperion, those three, I guess, are the best. I guess. I'm not really sure which one I use, but I, I remember from the first Borderlands that I had my character. It was like a level 45 character or something, and I remember that um, 
so high, Rack. And I remember that all the weapons that I was holding were all from one weapon manufacturer, so I was like, yeah, I, I probably like that manufacturer. Anyways, Doc Mercy's here. Gun zerkin time, bitch. Wow, that was lame. That was absolutely lame. <laughs> now I'm probably gonna die again. I mean, holy crap. Why am I actually wasting my ammo? God freaking damn it. I was just gun zerking up in here and then he actu actually killed me off. Um. Kind of a piss take. I mean, seriously. I'm kind of starting to think that my uh, perk, you know, when it comes to guns working, actually isn't that amazing. Maybe it's just me, but I, I, I don't really find it to be that amazing at this point. So you just, you, you might think, while Fraps was lagging, you might think that I actually considered the command a bit better. My answer is yes, but then again, I'm talking way too early. I mean, I still got crappy guns, I still got crappy stats, I still got a crappy shield. I don't have any grenade mods with me, I guess, so... You know, I'm, I still gotta give it some more time to check its badassery out. Anyways, you gotta do this again. Wait, if he's doing nothing, I can actually just use a grenade shot on him. There we go, criticals. Ow! God fucking damn it! I was doing nothing and I cannot shoot, damn it. See? Fuck, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go, I'm gonna go and run. Damn it! Damn, no. No, seriously? For fuck's sake. If this is the way it's gonna be, then I'm, then I'm not gonna cooperate. I'm just gonna give up. <laughs> and I'm just gonna do another quest. Oh, my character sucks! No! At this rate, I'm gonna make 200 parts just killing this guy. Ah, oh, and I'm losing a lot of money too. I gotta do another quest. I just got. I just gotta do something else, I guess. You know, like this one is absolutely crap. <laughs> Maybe I can just go back to sanctuary and. Um, it says that I gotta get myself a better shield if I do this. So. Is there a fast travel in here? There is a fast travel. Then we're just gonna go back to Sanctuary and go to Sir Amalok. Deliver the quest in. That's the way I want to do it. And see if he gets myself a better shield. You know, I don't really care if all the enemies respawn. Um, it's just that I'm, I'm such a crappy character right now. I need to get myself some better stuff. Maybe I need to get something for the Iridium thingy. If I got myself some iridium, that is. I don't really know. For some more ammo and stuff. Anyways. You see? What is it that you got for me? Um. Nah, I'm gonna go for the shield. It may be crappy, but I'm still gonna go for the shield. Uh. Is it the better shield, though? Uh, yay. Skin all locked. You know, like, holy crap, I got myself a level 11 shield. But why? <laughs> um, this one is... Let's see, can I compare? Yes, I can. Ah, it's just one capacity less, whatever, I'm gonna take it. <laughs> but that still leaves me, you know, with my skill points and all. You probably think, holy crap, how can you actually, you know, uh, doubt about your skill points? You just got four skill points. Still... I, I, I want to know. Uh, yeah, I need myself health regeneration. I mean, you know, that that's the thing. <laughs> yeah. I still need myself some good health regeneration. It's just that I have such low hit points. And I got myself such low stuff. Um... Yeah, I got myself just four iridium. That's not a whole lot, is it? Mm, now I'm just thinking, what can I do 
best. I mean, this medical mystery and this, these two are actually pretty freaking annoying. Um, the South and Shelf one is just 80 XP, so I'm gonna do that, you know, maybe off screen or whatever. Why is Fraps still lagging? Is my other question. I'm saying there's a lot, but, you know. <laughs> mm. Yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah, I still want to do this Doc Mercy thing. It's it's probably just the most straightforward one. It's it's relatively short. Um, it's just I got myself some crappy stats to do it with. That that's the annoying thing. So I guess I'm just gonna go back. I'm gonna try to do it again. I mean, you know. I know once you kill Doc Mercy, the quest isn't entirely done, but. Um, still, it's one that I really like to do. It's one who gives good experience points, I guess. I guess maybe Doc Mercy himself gives good experience points. And I mean the loot. I mean, like I said, last time I got myself an orange weapon. Chances are that I'm going to get myself another orange weapon. Once I finally manage to kill him, you know. I was a little bit confused when an actually accident in the car. So yeah, you know, I, I'm still tempting to do this. I still need to know, is there some nice loot waiting for me? Are there no bad guys? Oh, that's that's pretty cool, I guess. But God damn it, this this dude is is annoying. He's annoying. I gotta get myself a clear shot though, I mean, he's walking down pretty slowly. I still gotta wait until I get myself the perfect opening shot, you know. Because this dude is a bitch. And now he's hiding. Where is he? Oh, there he is. No, I gotta get myself a good shot now. That was a crappy shot. But really, I gotta hide. This thing hurts. Like, god damn it. So I gotta really take it easy in here. Like, I gotta go stop and reload. And then... Whoa, this dude is a fast fucker. Dude, seriously. How can you walk so fast? I gotta get some of my boomstick out then. If, if this is the case... No! You cannot be serious! Oh, seriously? No. I disapprove of this. <laughs> oh my god! This is impossible! This is absolutely impossible. Um. Wow. I uh, guess that I'm gonna do it this way. Then I'm just gonna go and say it out loud. I'm gonna, <laughs> then I'm gonna quit here for a little bit, and I think the next part is going to be with Ray because I think I'm gonna need myself some help with this. I got such crappy stats and I got myself such crappy weapons that, yeah, I need my get, I need to get myself some aid, and I think Ray Q will help me a lot with this. So I'm sorry if this episode or the episodes, I don't know how long I recorded today, um, are actually full of crap and piss and lots of failure. Still, I'm doing my best, but, you know, it's a little bit shitty. So, while I'm climbing on this house, <laughs> I'm just gonna say to you, thank you for watching. Like and favorite if you like the content. And subscribe to your channel, Rake Your Free, for more upcoming videos. And uh, I'll see you next time, hopefully with Ray. That'll be cool, you know, dual commentary again. It's been a while. So, peace.